so as you can see we have a Kia camera aka a dash cam um, I don't really know if you pronounce that name I get this off of Amazon um, I get a good deal on it or a uh, deal on two of them since we have multiple vehicles I'm going to go ahead and put one in each of them with all of this craziness that keep on happening on the road with the police or in case you get in any type of accident or so it's what you can prove or um, basically what you can prove so now with cameras everywhere you might as well have your own just to cover your butt because there's not a lot of honest people on the road and there's a lot of craziness that happen um, on the road or when your vehicle is even stationary so you might as well protect yourself as best as possible um, whichever that means having evidence um, the video or whichever way that can help you to deal with whatever situation you're going to deal with so as I say it is a Troy Tua dash cam um, 180p as stated on the local manual um, as I say camera is not too big light and then quick little thing what all comes in it is two local um local surprise brochures um they have one in spanish and they have one in english and if you open them up you do a review and you get a chance to win a 16 gigabyte memory card so if you order this that's a nice local thing go and go ahead and go online and fill that out so we can redeem that 16 16 inch memory card I'm going to use that for something else so I use it for one of these if we need to um, you get two glass mounts very simple application so stick on glass clip it down it holds to the glass release it it comes off the glass here is where you attach the bottom of the camera as you can see me already have it attached there um, you have three notches up top the center notch is where you would screw the base of the camera to your suction cup that would be attached to your glass your windshield over here you have a different type of USB port um, if you get that cable get that cable this USB port here is the one that comes with the car charger you have this mini one USB style. I'm going actually go ahead since me already have a USB outlet in my cigarette light. I'm going to get an extended one of these about 10 feet or so, or they have long about 10 feet is good for me. I'm just going to make it hang directly to the cigarette light on my vehicle. I'm not running all the way around the trim of the vehicle. And then you have this long one where if you just go and have this plugged in and you don't have no other USB connections are so this will be fine for you and this one is extremely long so either you wrap it up and run it straight to the cigarette lighter straight down or you can run it along the trim of your vehicle as seen in the in the manual here but I'm going to just run mine straight down to the cigarette lighter um, very simple um, as I say definitely would recommend getting one of these because of all this crazy stuff that keep on happening now out there um, it doesn't come with a memory card so I went ahead and bought one of these I bought a set of these uh, for Amazon it come up to about $12 um, sometimes they have different deals so be on the lookout for that these cameras are capable of using a max of 32 gigabyte usb card and as you can see the part that member i have the usb slot adapter where you can plug it into your laptop or so for easy access if you need to get the information or the video uh, for the camera um, the camera does have an internal battery but it does not last long so you're going to have to keep it plugged into some kind of power source but at the same time I would recommend you don't have it on all the time especially if your vehicle is parked because that can in some weird circumstances drain your battery so definitely pay attention to that but as I say whichever one you choose whatever style you choose I would definitely say it's a smart investment for you to have a dash cam um, a lot of people have cameras on their house now think of the vehicle as 
a extension of your house because if you don't have it you can't get where you need to go and if you don't protect it then you might as well say you're losing out so definitely invest in a um, dash cam um, this system also the port here you, that is also a rear view camera adapter plug so if you want add to the system and put a backup camera you can go ahead and do that um, the functions on it as you can see this is the screen it's not too too big but it do the job um, let me turn this upside to the right side so as you can see all of the buttons on the side here these are what they stand for on the side here power button is at the bottom um, different little features you can go through all of that in the manual when you get yours up top here is where you put your USB card um, very simple if you're familiar with mini USB cards already and then on the side you have up and down and then your menu button and then yeah and then also over here you can go through the different features as well so as you can see fits in the palm of my hand very light um, 180p the view angle is 170 wide angle as is stated there on the lens so for the price I would say it's definitely worth a try. I'm going to go ahead and hook this up in the truck and just make sure you know keep your truck cheap, keep your vehicle safe, monitor what's going on and keep yourself safe on the road in case anything crazy happen. You can turn it 360 degrees. So it's a good local investment to have. So until next time, definitely re recommend getting yourself a dash cam if you're on the road a lot or just in general to make sure say you can protect yourself from certain situations or have proof of certain things in certain situations so yeah man invest in one of them if you have the time and the cash is it nice check you later